Hello, my lovely little moonbeams. This is Christina, and welcome back to my channel, Moonchild Mama Tarot. On to my next deck. This is actually my newest. This came in the mail yesterday. It is the Dark Mansion Tarot. I am in love with this deck. It is in a very nice clamshell box. Um, I was hoping to find a nice little pouch for it but I haven't found one yet. The cardstock is really wonderful. It, I can't quite describe it, but it is, it's very beautiful. So these are the backs of it. It is etched in black. Only thing I don't like, and if anyone has any advice, it does it doesn't stick together, but it's almost like static is um, the friction is making it stick together oh, I have wanted the stack for so long it feels fantastic it is a very matte deck it feels buttery soft I mean the cardstock is just amazing it's perfect I love this deck this is probably going to quickly become my go-to deck. Um, I know my Witch's Tarot is my favorite deck, but this may have tied for um, her favorite deck with that now. Because the second I opened this and I had it in my hands, the energy was just phenomenal. I mean, I love all of the little details in it. It's just but yeah, if anyone has any advice on how to prevent these from sticking together so much I am ready to hear it because it is driving me nuts I can't overhand shuffle it because it just goes in clumps and my husband was looking at it last night and he's like holding it and it's like it just yeah I think that's the only thing I don't like about it right now and I wish there was a way that It is Ryder Waite Smith imagery. Um, there is no doubt about that. Now this is just the regular edition. There is also, I believe, one that has gold edging, and then there is a larger one um, that has the gold edging also. They actually sent two sample cards of that. So, if I can get to them real quick. Okay. So ugh. sit back down. This is the um, 
larger size. It is edged in gold. And one of the other differences in the card backs are actually different. They did send, like I said, they sent me two, um, two sample cards of those. This one is significantly higher price tag, so, you know, but I loved the backs on these, like, hands down. I love this deck. I don't think I want the special edition one. <clears throat> but you never know. If Tim Burton ever had a tarot deck, I feel like this is the one he would have. <laughs> it reminds me of my Nightmare Before Christmas, Frank and Weenie, you know, The Corpse Bride. It just... It, it feels very Tim Burton-esque. And I think that is why I love it. I mean, just look at the artwork. They spent two and a half years um, working on this deck. And it shows. It is phenomenal. Like I said, I actually only got it in yesterday and it's already completely um, completely won me over. Let me show you how it shuffles. It is on the thicker side of the deck. Decks. But it does shuffle very, very nicely. As always, thank you so much for tuning in. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell um, so you can stay up to date on all of the wonderful content I have heading your way. And as always, have a good night.